In this video, I'm going to show you how to define margin above elements using CSS margin top, and we're getting started right now. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab, where we help you code better so you can earn more for yourself, for your business, and for your clients. And if it's your first time here, make sure you hit the subscribe button, then hit the bell notification icon so you're notified when I publish more awesome tutorials. With that out of the way, Let's head over to the screen capture and learn how to apply margin top to your CSS and your HTML, and I'll see you there. On the left-hand side, we have some HTML markup with some CSS rules. On the right-hand side, we see what, is, what it looks like in a browser. And I'm gonna add some margin to the top of the blue box. So in my setup here, my blue box is the third box, and I'm just gonna type in margin top and then I'm gonna add 10 pixels. Save the page, and when I refresh this, you're gonna see the blue box is gonna move down slightly. It's moved down 10 pixels. And that is how you apply a margin top. There's another way you can do this, and that is by typing in margin, and have 10 pixels, and then zero, zero, zero. And that will, there'll be no change when I refresh this page, because the very first entry when you have margin, the very first entry is the top of the element, the next one is the right, then the bottom, then the left, so those are all set to zero, so those are unchanged, and we just have a margin at the top. The way you choose to do it is a matter of preference. You can use margin and fill in all four of the values, or just use margin-top to just fill in the one value. It's up to you. And that's how easy it is to apply margin top in your CSS. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, hit that subscribe button, then hit the bell notification icon that appears so you're notified when I publish more awesome tutorials. And next up is clicking one of these videos on the right hand side so you can learn some more awesome coding stuff. It's quick, it's easy, it's simple, it's fun. Learn more stuff, click one of these videos. And until next time, keep crushing it and I will see you in the next video.